Hello and welcome everyone. I'd like to thank all of you for joining today's session on Ask the Expert, Migrating Customizations from V8i to Connect. My name is Tom Stogdell and I'll be your presenter for today's session. Along with me I have Tim Hickman. Tim will be the moderator for today's session and will help address any questions that we have. During today's session we're going to talk about how to migrate customizations from your V8i workspaces to the MicroStation Connect Edition. Some of what we're going to talk about is how to migrate custom tools, toolboxes, tasks, changes to the menu bar, and context menus from your V8i workspace into MicroStation Connect. Please type any questions that you may have into the chat window. Today's session is all about any questions that you may have regarding customizing and migrating customizations from MicroStation V8i to Connect Edition. Either Tim or myself will answer those questions as we go throughout the session. Let's begin by examining a custom workspace in MicroStation V8i. Customization can mean different things to different people. This can range from a few custom tools placed in a custom toolbox to complete interfaces configured for various types of users within different departments or disciplines, delivering a true custom experience to those users. Here we have users being implemented for different types of user roles within our organization. Projects is used for different design projects that are currently underway. Each user delivers a different custom interface by supplementing the standard V8i user interface with additions to the menu bar, custom tools and toolboxes, tasks and workflow tasks, right-click context menus, and more. We are going to examine some of those customizations linked to one of those users. To get started, a design file will be opened, allowing us to explore the user interface or UI. Immediately upon entering MicroStation, you can see interface customizations in several forms, one of which is the menu bar. A custom menu, Myco Engineering, contains menu items to activate applications, links to various document resources, and a variety of custom tools as well. The interface also contains custom tasks, including workflow tasks. All of these items are useful to the users in our organization and something they rely upon to conduct business each and every day. The interface also contains a custom right-click context menu. This context menu is also another way that users can interact with the custom interface. Now, let's open the customized dialog and examine this customization in greater detail. Customization is stored in a configured design library. There are currently two DGN libs shown, each of which is delivering custom interface components, including custom tools and toolboxes. You can also see the tasks and workflow tasks we just looked at in the tasks dialog. Also can be seen are the menu bar customizations and the context menus. As an organization, a great deal of time and effort has been put into creating this custom interface. When looking at moving from the current version of MicroStation into the MicroStation Connect Edition, you do not have to lose any of this customization, but rather it can be migrated from the existing V8i installation into the new MicroStation Connect Edition configuration. To begin migrating this customization, a copy of the DGN lib that contains the customization will be placed in a MicroStation Connect Edition workspace that was created for this purpose. Now that the design library is in place, Let's open a DGN file in the MicroStation Connect Edition from within the workspace and work set that is to be used in migrating the customization that we have examined in V8i. To start with, the V8i tasks are immediately available for use. These can be displayed in the ribbon without conversion using the task navigation workflow. Once this workflow has been selected, the task navigation icon is made available allowing the tasks stored in the DGN library to be accessed. You can see the same tasks here that were available in V8i.
To begin customizing the ribbon, the Customize Ribbon dialog must be opened. This can be done by right-clicking in a blank area within the ribbon. Once the Customize Ribbon dialog is displayed, observe the file name shown in the title of this dialog. The file name, personal.dgnlib, is a configured design library that is a part of every user's preferences. Unlike in the past, a user can always customize. If the active file is not a configured design library, customizations will automatically be written to this file. We wish to make any customizations created available to multiple users. As such, a specific design library will now be opened. Again, let's open the Customize Ribbon dialog. Observe that the file name, shown at the top of the Customize Ribbon dialog, has changed to that of the active file. Customizations will now be written to this DGN lib. When customizing, in Choose Components From, it is possible to select the MicroStation Connect Editions buttons, ribbon containers and components, as well as import items. This includes customization from V8i that is stored in the OpenDGN library. When Menu Customizations is selected, the Myco Engineering Custom Menu Bar editions are available. Let's create a new workflow to add these customizations to. Once the workflow has been created, ribbon tabs can then be added. We can migrate the menu customizations, custom tools, etc. to the new ribbon tab. When complete, click Apply to save the changes. The updates are then immediately available within the user interface. As you can see, bringing customization from an older generation of MicroStation into the MicroStation Connect Edition is something that can be done. You do not have to leave your custom tools, toolboxes, and other custom interface components behind. These can be brought forward into the ribbon style interface in the MicroStation Connect Edition.